Zombie Apocalypse. Hey there, friends. Have you ever wondered what is better, Camtasia, Screencastify, or Wii Video? What if instead I told you that they can all work together to make cool things? Check this out. Right now, I am recording with Camtasia. But at the exact same time, I'm going to show you in the next training movie, I can record with Screencastify. And then I'm going to bring that Screencastify video into we video. In the immortal words of Tony Stark, is it better to be feared or respected? And I'm thinking we should respect all three. Check this training out. Alright ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to teach you Screencastify quick. Make sure that you've got your vehicle so that it's working. I will just show you one other cool thing that I thought to add afterwards. If you bring in wall starter, uh, it's best to do while it's paused. So I'm going to pause the game and I'm going to bring in wall starter it also gives you something that you can drive and hit which of course is fun um, play pause clone and pay and all of a sudden now I've got a building that I can knock over if my car is fast enough uh, check it out the car can do loops but here's what I want to teach you on screencastify go back to chrome click on your chrome tab click on apps click on the web store and then I want you to type screen castify. Add that to Chrome. Choose yes on add extension. And when you add it, note it, give, it gives you this little picture, which is a piece of film and tells you you can also do alt shift s. s. All right, I'm going to try and record two at once because I'm going to teach you how to record while I record. So let's see if this will work. When I hit Screencastify, it pops up the setup camera. We do want to set up camera access. We do want to allow it the microphone, and we do want to store to Google Drive. Those are all equal, easy things. When we sign in and ask who you want to sign is, you, in as, use your school account. I am allowing it to access both of mine. I'm going to tell it to skip tab recording. You're going to write down student. Uh, I am a student, but this is my teacher account, and I am over 13 years old. Thank you for your help, and we can hit OK. Instead of watching their tutorial, I'm going to just show you and watch how this works. I'm going to click Screencastify, and here's what I'm so excited about. I can record the desktop. You can see it's already recording my microphone, which is amazing because it's also recording it with my other tool. But when I hit Record Desktop, it says, what part do you want to do? And I say, I want to do this screen. I just happen to have three because of my computers. You'll all have two when you're using my desktops or one on your Chromebook. When I hit share, she counts down and check it out. I am now recording my screen. And what makes this crazy cool is I could actually record my crash in fun. So I'm going to go back to my fun car and this stuff actually gets recorded as a WebM. I'm going to click the little stop sharing, which is down at the bottom of the screen, but you couldn't see it. And it pops up the window showing me recording two times at once. I'm going to hit pause. I'm going to click up top to rename it. And I'm going to call it Fun uh, Show Off. And I'm going to hit close. It is automatically up to uploaded to the Google Drive. And then check this out. If I go to We Video allow it to have its offline access. I'm going to start a new project called Fun Car and I just want it to be a personal project and I hit next. I'm going to skip the ad media for a second and just tell it create video and then I want to upload a new piece of footage to this so I'm going to go to my Google Drive. I do want to allow it to have access I go to the Screencastify folder, and bam, there is my new file being added. Just like that. Click the little X when it turns green, go back to My Media, and boom, I can add titles and all my cool stuff, trim and adjust my awesome video, even in programs like Fun, which have nothing to do with Chrome. 
So you don't have to do that training, but I just want you to know that it's possible. There you have it. Some quick explanations of why we should respect all three of those applications for video recording. Unicorn Zombie Apocalypse.